Well, hey guys, uh, this is Daniel back again. This is uh, part two of the Berna tuning video, power tuning. Um, what we're doing is uh, adjusting the screw back here at the back. Um, had some favorable numbers, but uh, in uh, you know uh, trying to change out the cylinder so we weren't you know using a a, a weak cylinder, we were also uh, making the uh, the thing ice cold, so um, which decreases the performance. So, so anyway, um, took it inside, uh, let it and all the CO 2s all get back to the room temperature in the house, and now we are going to see. This is uh, counter counterclockwise turns. Sorry. Um, so uh, we did uh, six and a half or six and a quarter, seven and a quarter. I lost track. Of, of uh of turns i think it was a yeah, six and a quarter i believe anyway uh that's when it uh, bottomed out and that's turning it clockwise um so so basically we've got it uh, turned all the way clockwise and um <clears throat> i'm going to uh, compare this to the first string that i did um before it was modified at all uh, same same ammo and this is uh this is some uh some rubber balls here you uh, know these are actually soft rubber balls but um after we test a couple of these wow phone come on um after we test a couple of these then um we're actually gonna throw some uh burna uh, kinetic balls in there and see what they say too so all right um Pierce the cylinder. Cylinder's pierced. And away we go. 272 out of the gate. Alright, so 272. Grain, 43.6 grains, so that's 9.7 joules. <laughs> 292. What? Wow. Okay, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna put up some uh, simple comparison numbers uh in uh, in uh, either in the comments or i might get lazy and just like draw it on something and hold it up in front of the camera anyway so uh duplicate so another 292 wow all right so what i'm gonna do right now three shots in i'm gonna go ahead and uh, dump the rest of those green ones and Throw a couple of the burner kinetics in there. Okay, so here we go. Yikes. 262. So actually, uh, the 292, let's go back to that real quick. Uh, the 292, um, that put us at 11.18 .18 joules. Okay. So then this uh, this 262, that's the burners. They're 46.2 grains.
I had that extra number in there and you're telling me I was like at 90 some jewels. I was like, yeah, I don't, I don't think so. Uh, so that hit 9.5. Okay, so it's another 262. more of these. 260. Yeah. Um, I just want to get a couple of those. I'm hoping uh, it's just probably um, I was kind of just wanting to fire a couple of those before the cylinder got depleted. Um, and I'm going to see, go back and see uh, what I did on that. But honestly, uh, with temperature differences and everything, uh, nothing really major. Um, so anyway, what I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to fire uh, two more. And actually, so they're kind of at a disadvantage because I did waste uh, three shots on the burner. But I'm going to do two more of these green ones. 280 273 All right so Here are the numbers. Uh, the original run, the uh, original run we did. Hang on one second, I'm so sorry. I realize I can't triple check. Okay, here we go. So these are same same ball comparisons. Um, Okay, so <clears throat> ammo for ammo, this is what we've got. Gr both green balls, uh, green rubber squishy balls. Uh, <laughs> um, this is the Berna before we turn the screw. This is the Berna after I turn the screw. So, there you have it. So that, uh, let's see here. Let me see if I can find. Uh, so the highest, uh, as, as far as the jewels go, um, I guess the highest, yeah, so 292. But now we are. Last thing that we can we can do Um Alright, so eleven point one. Right, so eleven point right, so one joules is gonna be the highest that we could get with the green ball ammo. And 
9.0 Okay, so I'm sorry that was really really uh, slow um, Anyway, so there you have it uh, Before the turn 9 joules after the turn 11 joules so 2 joules of energy gain just by turning that screw There you go Peace